court hearing today for the only person charged in the Raleigh Christmas Parade tragedy. An 11-year-old girl died from her injuries after being hit by a truck during the parade. We are committed to following the investigation into what happened that day. Tamara Scott joins us now live with what happened in court this morning. Tamara, good, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Well, despite not being required to be in court today based on the misdemeanor charges, Landon Glass did show up with his attorney to face a judge this morning where she uh, laid out a slew of the charges that he's faced with, one of which could send him behind bars for 150 days. Now, 20 year old Glass is charged with misdemeanor death by motor vehicle, among several other charges following the death of 11 year old Haley Brooks on November 19th during the Raleigh Christmas Parade. Today in court, the judge read off all of the charges and continued his case. The most serious of these charges is a class one misdemeanor offense, which carries a maximum sentence of 150 days. Prior records show Glass was charged numerous times for state law vehicle violations in Virginia. The violations date back to February of 2021. The charges range from multiple failures to have a vehicle inspected to numerous window tint violations. Police say Glass was driving the vehicle which was carrying the CC and company dance float when he lost control and hit Haley Brooks. Now Glass is also charged with careless and reckless driving and proper equipment and unsafe movement and carrying a firearm in a parade. His case was continued till March 29th at 2 p.m. Tamara Scott, ABC 11 Eyewitness News.